I didn't want to leave Chicago because I really like the Chicago area. And um, I guess with Benedictine, I liked that it was close by and it's still in the Chicago area, but it had a diverse program with faculty that were actually active in public health and not just teaching. Georgine Poliak and Alyssa Ostebo, they both were active in public health outside of their roles as faculty. They were great because they brought in all of their outside experience plus book experience and they were just offered a very well-rounded program and well-rounded classes. Um, so the stuff I learned just spread across what I do and that's why I can use it every day. When you come in and you're fresh out of school and you've never had a job in public health before, you, you don't know what you're doing, but when you've also learned what you're supposed to do on the job as well as everything that's in the books, it sets you ahead of the curve, so you're ready to get rolling on those first couple days. So, my initial impressions when I went to Benedictine, I had been to the campus once, and when I first got there, I, I didn't know what to expect, um, but it was nice. It had a nice sort of neighborly feel, which Living in downtown, I wasn't accustomed to, but it was nice to get out to the campus and have that feel when I was in classes. I would recommend the um, students to Benedictine if they're looking for public health and nutrition, especially the dual degree program. I think I, one of my favorite things about it is that it is flexible, that there are the night courses and that there are weekend courses. And if you're already involved in a career that's in the field, but you're just looking to advance yourself, it's a way that you can advance yourself without having to take time off from your work to do it. Um, but it's also a place that's a big go if, like myself, they were just new in the field and straight out of undergrad and looking to go on and keep